Now we see the concept of Chitta Prasadana. Patanjali defines yoga as the cessation of mental modifications. Cessation or control of mental modification, removal of men mental modifications or restraint of mental modifications. We have seen we control our mind from taking various forms, chitta vrutis, five chitta vrutis we have, is it? That only the cessation of mental modification is known as yoga, according to the great sage Patanjali Maharshi. Here, this chitta prasadana technique is one of the practical and effective technique prescribed by the great sage Patanjali Maharshi for bringing about peace, calmness, tranquility and clarity in the mind. Why we use this technique, Chitta Prasadana? When we need this technique, let us see here in this slide. Uh, this technique involves taking four different approaches or attitudes towards four different types of people. Happy people, unhappy people, virtuous people, vicious people. Is it four different types of people or qualities of people? Patanjali says, first he says, develop friendship with happiness or happy people. He is telling, try to close to happy people or you cultivate happiness, inner happiness. When you are surrounded by happy people, you can grow well. He is telling us, okay, when we are surrounded by, uh, surrounded with uh, happy people, then there is a chance we to grow well. Next, the second point, uh, second technique, develop compassion towards unhappiness or those who are suffering. So, he is telling, in spite of showing pity on uh, un unhappiness people or uh, suffering uh, uh, the people who are suffering you just show compassion compassion means kindness show kindness uh, listen to them try to understand their problems so that uh, you can help them so here this uh, technique uh, second technique tells, tells third technique take delight or joy in virtuous or virtuous people appreciate virtuous people Appreciate virtuous doings, virtuous deeds. Great sage, he is, he is telling here. So, appreciate virtuous people and appreciate virtuous deeds, virtue deeds, he is telling here. Now, fourth is the fourth technique. Be equanimous towards vices or people exhibiting negative qualities. This happens, is it? Negative, when we are surrounded by negative people, they disturb us like anything. They disturb us and our mind gets disturbed. That time, he is telling how we should be, we should be, we should maintain this uh, equanimity. Uh, we should, um, uh, we should maintain a sense of uh, peace, a sense of uh, calmness during that time. Is telling us these are the techniques in order to control ourselves, in order to um, make our emotions balanced. Emotions balanced. See, uh, in our day to day life, the mind becomes disturbed. Yes, because we invariably take exactly the opposite approach to what is prescribed by, by Patanjali. What we do? We do opposite. Is it? Here Patanjali is telling four techniques. Uh, you do friendship with happy people. Is it? Otherwise you just uh, develop happiness, inner happiness is telling. Second one is show compassion towards unhappiness people. Third is uh, encourage or appreciate good deeds, good people. Uh, fourth one is 
when you are surrounded by negative quality uh, negative people who has negative qualities then you should maintain sense of peace sense of calmness uh, and not letting negative affect us is it is telling so but what we do we do exactly opposite we'll see this in next slide we shy away from friendship with people who are happier than us okay we shy away away, uh, away from friendship with people who are happier than us we don't want to do friendship with uh, happy uh, with uh, happy people who are happier than more than us so we uh, that is wrong here we have to change our mindset mindset and uh, we have to cultivate that technique we have to follow that technique we show pity rather than compassion towards those who are suffering what we do when we see um, these people unhappy people what do we do we show pity on them so he is telling don't show pity show compassion listen to them understand their problems so that you can help them is telling us third one is we start comparing ourselves okay comparing ourselves with or become jealous of people who are endowed with virtuous or good qualities this jealous word is very this jealous quality is very danger quality we should not have okay jealous ruins us what we do we feel jealous of good deeds jealous of good people so we should not do that one we become emotionally disturbed when facing people who have negative qualities this happens is it we should not we should not uh, emotionally imbalanced when we are surrounded by negative quality negative uh, negative people who has negative qualities we have to maintain sense of peace sense of calmness we should not we should not let somebody or negative things affect us we become emotionally disturbed this uh, disturbed when uh, facing people who have negative qualities incidentally this technique of chitta prasadana with its four approaches can advantageously applied uh, toward even the same individual with whom we are living when he or she goes four stages happiness and happiness virtue and virtuous people so happiness do friendship with the happy people okay uh, cultivate happiness unhappiness show compassion towards unhappiness people appreciate virtue virtue deeds okay appreciate virtue virtuous people vicious vicious okay uh, balance yourself when you are surrounded by negative people these are the four techniques are given by the great sage patanjali maharshi in order to in order to maintain uh, maintain our mind emotionally balanced okay uh, to um, to get peace of mind sense of mind we need to adopt these four approaches this is about chitta prasadana